just love horses. You know, it's, it's, a, it's a passion. You've got to have it. If you haven't got the passion, well, are you doing the right job? We're battlers. We, to be honest, we're battlers. Basically, we only race what we can't sell. Racing was hard. State money was poor. It's sort of like left a lot of people wondering, should we be doing this? But state money is going up now, and it's fantastic money at the moment. Daniel could have well sold this horse, but he decided to keep him. So, and that's really good for us. Danny's just a wonderful person. There's a real passion there and a real love for the horse, and you can see that through. And, and a lot of the good trainers, you can certainly see that with. And uh, yeah, Danny's horses go looking for him. And after every gallop, I've always said to Dan Daniel and Danny, I said, "Like, right, it's going to take a good horse to beat this one." Some horses are different. Right, th this horse has given me a good feel right from the day day one. You know, um, he just gives you. Not many horses like it. They're, they're pretty hard to come by. Horses like him. Like I've been in the game for 35, just over 35 years, and I've, I've never found one like him. I've never ridden anything as good as him. Oh, he's just got the X factor. You know, a lot of horses haven't got that. Did most of his fast weeks that day. He'll just, um, he'll probably run about 106 this morning. That's just basically just steady galloping without too much pressure on at all, you know? So they've gone 106.3, exactly what I wanted. I should have taken out the hold. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was good though. Yeah, he's it's good. fitting so well. Yeah. He doesn't get tired. No. You want to carry, carry on like that? Yeah. <laughs> Don't get much better than that. He's pulled up really good from his work. He didn't do a lot, so he's happy. He have a roll and a wash and go in his paddock for the day and can't do any more now, really. Get him down there and hopefully he travels well. Pay it by you. It's good to see a horse roll after they work. It means they're happy, generally. If they're not rolling and they're standing there a bit stressed, either you've done too much work with them or they're not a happy horse. I like to see them have a roll. But he never changes. His attitude is always good. His feed bin's always good. His temperature's always the same, 37.4. He just, he has that ability in the heart, you know? Simple as that. Uh, he's a relaxed horse, but he really uses himself very, very well. You could see that as a young horse as well. Everything was just put together, those short pastings, um, but good forearm and a bit of strength. That nat natural athleticism really uh, just and it holds him there, and he's, he's got a brain. He's an intelligent horse, and uh, when he strides out, he really strides out. Crosshaven's uh, won a stakes race at a mile. Uh, that's uh, the, the half brother to his dam. Uh, Kalani's the same way. He's won the white rope um, uh, group three over a mile. Um, the dam showed a, a really good turn of foot over 13 and 1400 with, with very limited starts and really found the line. Um, and I suppose looking at the horse himself, his, his best in his races are always the last 100 metres. He really starts striding out and, and letting down. Um, so I, I'm not too worried about the mile, to be fair. I don't think the mile's going to worry him, I really don't. I mean, he can relax, he can accelerate, he can do what he has to do. Um, the sectionals have been pretty amazing all the way through his career. And um, if they give him a couple of soft ones, they'll pay. Oh, jeez. Uh, we did a dream, uh, we did a dream. But uh, no, it would be a great thrill. It would be a great thrill. It's uh, the group ones are the pinnacle, and um, yeah, it would be a be a wonderful outcome. But I've always said the, the best part of this game is the people that you meet in the game. Um, and just being fortunate to be uh, surrounded by you know, wonderful people, wonderful friends, and um, getting uh, wonderful advice along the way as well from them. So every time he's been asked, he extends. And I still think, I do believe we haven't extended him fully yet. I just, I just know there's a wee bit more there. Could he be the horse you've been waiting for? Yes. Without a doubt. <laughs>